Hello, welcome to my channel, Mr. Sales Teaches English. If you look at my most popular uploads, you'll see that I'm really interested in the A and the A star. Um, so this year, 90% of the students at my school in English got um, a C or above. And I thought to myself, wow, that's pretty impressive, isn't it? That puts us in the top 5% in the country. How on earth are we going to get better? And uh, I've had a look at the AQA exam. And what I've done that's different to um, anyone else that I know on YouTube is that I actually sit the exam under exam conditions. And then I learn from that and make the videos. So I'm starting to go a little bit crazy uh, now. Uh, I teach full time, but as you can see why, um, how often I'm uploading now, um, I'm going to be releasing more and more videos and you're going to become increasingly prepared for the GCSE exams. So I spent last term writing this, the Mr. Sally's Guide to 100% in AQA English Language GCSE. Um, I realised actually that if um, I taught my students how to get 100%, many of them will get in the 90s. Uh, so you can see from the contents pages that there's an awful lot to cover there, a huge amount that um, it will teach you. Well, this isn't to advertise the the book so much. You'll see that when it comes out. But I'll be making lots of videos um, to go along with it to show you how to get 100%. So if that would appeal to you, please subscribe. This term, I'm also going to do a bit of a shout out for an amazing English teacher called Rob Ward, uh, who has a blog. You can find him at rodwardwebwordpress.com. Uh, I'm sure you can just put that in uh, to Google. And uh, have a look at this. People who sell resources annoy me. In fact, they infuriate me. Uh, so he's giving his uh, resources away for free, uh, which is what I do on YouTube. I tell all my students, if you don't want me to earn any money, just click off the advert. If the advert runs, I get about one cent, which is fantastic. Um, uh, I get paid. Um, you let the advert run for 10 seconds and we're both happy. But anyway, what he's produced is a series of workbooks. Um, I haven't had my um, an opportunity to work through all of them, but I want to take you to two of them in my channel this month, uh, and probably this term. He's done an absolutely brilliant one on Dr. Jekyll and Hyde, and another fantastic one on Macbeth. So here's the Macbeth one, and I'm so excited about this because... Uh, He's introduced other texts that are really quite interesting, but um, they therefore help you prepare for the English language exam and at the same time give you vocabulary that you can use to write about Macbeth. It's real joined up thinking. He also makes some really fascinating links to uh, other writers. And uh, if you've heard of the word Machiavellian, this idea of um, scheming and plotting, it comes from... Uh, Machiavelli, who wrote this book called The Prince. Uh, I won't tell you loads about it now, but it's fascinating the links that he starts to make between Macbeth and other ideas at the time. And again, it's absolutely fantastic preparation for the persuasive style of writing that you do on the English language exam, but also he takes out some really high level vocabulary that you can use in your essays about Macbeth. And of course, Machiavelli is, is writing about how a prince can keep power. So it's totally relevant to your study of Macbeth. Um, gives you this brilliant vocabulary, uh, but also at the same time you're revising for your English language exam. It really is genius. I'm so excited that I'm going to start making some videos here uh, to force you to get an A or an A star, whether you want it or not. So if that interests you, subscribe to my channel. Um, the a booklet on uh, Dr. Jekyll and Hyde is even better because it has example answers in it. It goes on forever. Um, there's so much detail and it is free. You don't have to wait for my videos. You can actually download these for yourself and start studying from them. And what's so fantastic about that is no matter how rubbish your teaching is in class or perhaps your teaching is brilliant but the behaviour of the students in the class isn't so good, or perhaps your teaching is fantastic, but they're just not showing you how to get the a, a star. Really, you've got to download these. Look, it goes on forever and ever and ever. I've just flicked through to page 32 out of 88. 
it's yours to play with you don't have to read every page uh, it's a godsend so Rob Ward I salute you um, I'm gonna be making these videos uh, really really intensely like you know three or four a week you're gonna learn so much please subscribe enjoy your studies because it's gonna be fascinating